One thing that can't be hidden for too long is the sun and the moon and the truth that I keep spit on the mic daily. So uh, shout out to everybody in the chat. Like I said, we just getting started. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble. So click on that like button. Obviously, these decavs hate the truth, but they are here listening to it. You know, starting off, uh, we're going to start off with what Mike Tyson had to say and many more from Prince Nassim Hamed, my favorite fighter, and um, Danny Garcia versus Errol Spence, Devin Haney, Layla Ali, uh, Carissa Shield. We got a lot to talk about today, so let's go ahead and uh, get it rolling. Starting off with Mike Tyson, Shannon the Cannon, he came out on a live stating the money is there. The money is almost there. I will leave it at that. So he hinting at a fight between him and Mike Tyson when he got axed on that. Now, uh, at first, uh, you know, they were rumors, but then they debunked it. And now Shannon the Cannon talking about they talking. They in talks and they almost about to make the fight. I would love to see an exhibition between the two. I think Shannon the Cannon still got it more so than Mike Tyson. But of course, Mike Tyson, he the original Mike. You know, he the original boogeyman. Just like Aki on Split Decision. Like I told y'all, they, they got me feeling like the Iron Mike on Split Decision. They don't even got the cojones to debate. But with that being stated, it's an interesting exhibition match to me. Uh, Shannon the Cannon got a lot of power, so does Mike. But just like Tyson's favorite quote, everybody got a game plan till they get hit. So Mike Tyson could look good on the pads, but I don't think it's a wise idea to do an exhibition right now. But he's looking good, um, but you won't really know till you there fighting for real and you getting hit. You don't know how your body will react at 53. Father Tom undefeated. There was only one fighter that really beat Father Tom, but he stopped at 40 years old. Hopkins did it till he was 50 years old. And I don't know if it was God playing, but he got put out of the arena almost. He the oldest champion ever. The oldest heavyweight champion was George Foreman. And he won a title at 45. So, like I said, um, an exhibition match really ain't all that. But at the end of the day, you're still getting hit. I don't give a damn if it's uh, my, my language. But I don't care if it's a headgear or no headgear. You're still getting hit with a whole lot of force. And the brain is not meant to be hit, especially at an old age. And let's not forget, Mike really be smoking a whole lot. So does he even really have the stamina? So uh, drop in your comment section. Who would y'all prefer Mike Tyson fight next? Uh, would y'all want him to fight Shannon the Cannon? Or do y'all prefer somebody else? Subscribe below if you're trying to get smart about the minute. If you're trying to get dumb about a second, don't. And listen to these decafs slash old media that don't know ish about boxing. So, with that being stated, don't don't be a decaf. Don't be don't be a guy that's eating contaminated meat that don't have a cojon, that don't have cojones. Y'all got me feeling like all y'all decafs got female parts. As soon as the life is over. Y'all in the comment section talking all that ish like the keyboard warriors y'all are. But when I'm on the show, y'all got me feeling like the Iron Mike, the most feared, the young Aki at the young age. Nobody want to smoke. But this ain't a fight. It's a debate. You don't even got the cojones to debate Aki. Like I said, the truth will set you free. And there's two sides to it. When the truth is spoken, the other side ain't nothing but a lie. And when you go against the truth, guess what's, what's going to happen? You're going to get knocked out. Y'all decaf's too easy. I could knock you out with an uppercut. Right hook, left hook, jab, right hand. It's too easy. Like I said, I'm yet to have an intelligent debate back and forth where I'm debating with somebody and I'm actually uh, enjoying it. Like I said, y'all making it too easy on our key. So with that being said, y'all got me feeling like the Mayweather of split decision. Undefeated record with 412 fights or debates, I should say. And 412 knockouts. Easy work. And like I always tell y'all. All these decaves. Why y'all always hating? As soon as the live is over. Please, please tell me why you always hating. Why you 
<laughs> yeah, I hate it. <laughs> so, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and take it out. I appreciate everybody in the comment section. I bear witness there's only one God. Allah and Muhammad is his final messenger.